Escape from Tarkov over any other game I can think of caters to the chads, the sweats, the neckbeard gamers with nothing left to do but shit on the most vulnerable yet useful members of society among us. Whether you're a dad, young professional, or blue collar worker, there's no level of value you can bring to the world that will save you from the 12 hour day giga goof that no life's this game. So you may be asking yourself, what the hell am I doing playing this game? For all of you newcomers that are not subscribed yet, by the way, that'd be a lot cooler if you did. Just saying, you know, please subscribe. I would not be considered someone that is particularly good at competitive gaming wow blacks up my leg really I just blew myself up with a grenade and with that being said, do I still experience all the same feelings that this game is manufactured to induce? Do I get that tickle in my balls when I get out of a deadly raid with a crucial quest item or valuable piece of loot I had to pry out of some part-time player's cold, dead hands? The short answer to this is a resounding yes, and far more than any Giga Chat can ever comprehend, because the pounding in my chest that happens every time I make a play that just so happens to work out in my favor is a drug I could never kick and the incremental improvements I derive from it are the feeling I look for in any challenge, and Escape from Tarkov is damn challenging. To prove this, Bucky and I decided to take on one of the easiest tasks to exist in Tarkov to show you just how crazy things can get, survive a raid in customs. And for those of you who aren't aware of the kind of person Bucky is, well, let me give you a little backstory. This man has played Tarkov since the game came out, and at this point he is numb to the pain, rushing every gunshot there is to be heard in hopes of ringing out at least one last drop of dopamine he thinks there's a possibility to get, only to secure a kill-death ratio your grandmother could be. Nade and clear, nade and clear. I haven't looted a single thing. You do you, I'm very dead. Oh, that guy, I'm dead. I'm very dead. Ouch. My bad. Ow, ow, help me. Run! I'm dead from I don't know where. I... Jake, you broke my legs! Oh, sh**. <laughs> and with all that being covered, can a normie enjoy Escape from Tarkov? Well, let's see for ourselves. So nice outside. Uh... I hate this bomb. That sounds horrifying. Fighting over in those storage units. 200 ping. Ooh. Fighting. Okay, that's got like long dominant. I got one tap by Scav on customs earlier from like a mile and a half away. I'm traumatized right now. I don't know if I killed him. Might have. Might have, yeah. Servers are on fire. <laughs> and for no reason, too. I can't imagine tons of people are playing this game or something. Everyone went to SP Tarkov for two days, realized how f boring it yeah, was. Yeah, yeah. Right, going back. Dude, the website is still. Like, I can barely move on that website. Alright, best time to play SP Tarkov. Yeah, everybody's right. Have fun, you playing know. it, yeah. I don't know. Zero interest. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Back up. Back up. What do you want me to do? Got some nades? We gotta take these motherfuckers out. I don't have any nades. Great. That's the best way to take in these guys. Shoot him in the face. I don't know 
if I just got Rashala. Nice healing is right here. Bro, he's just running away. Shot him so many times. Passing an aid. Back up. Toss a nade in between the uh, tanker and the wall, okay? Uh, okay. Nope, oh, I think it's all of them. I think there's more here, I just felt I saw one. Uh, the shawl is dead, I think I got him. There's a dead one here. Looks like it. Stealing my Rashala loot, bitch. Pretty sure I got him. Pretty sure I got him, bitch. <laughs> he was. Oh. Thank you. Yeah, it was you. I shot him in the face multiple times. Oh, okay. You can take it. It's fine. I have zero bullets left. I mean, what what does he have that's particularly crazy? You have a Bitcoin. Take that gold TT. He doesn't have a gold TT. Oh, well, you got the. Sh on them. <laughs> Check his pockets. His like, pockets are the mags. Yeah, but he can have a chance for like a Bitcoin. Right, right. No, he doesn't really have shit, honestly. I don't know. You can take like his attachments off his AK or something. Not That's great. all you really do. Uh. Any of them have a backpack? No. Oh, well, okay. definitely not Rashala, but let me check. How many guards are there? It should be like four or five. Backpack. Oh, have dog <laughs> reticles. Man, Rashala oh sucks. Yeah, he's got sh He used to be such a fun boss. Why is he so bad now? Alright, I'm going out back. I'm just making my way to the ZB exit. Collecting spark plugs. Fuel tank, and I got me a little water filter. It's not you and Grep. You're not near me, right? No. I'm in streamer room. Good chance. I think I just heard someone at the X, so I'm not gonna lie to you. Well, I am on my way. Could beat my pants a little bit. Mechanic shop thing. The one with the boxes. Yeah. I'm almost there. Oh, f somebody's shooting me. Where are you? I'm inside the place still. I'm, I'm f***ed up. Where? I don't know. You don't know where you are? Uh, I am beside streamer room outside. I'm going back inside. I'm gonna go upstairs, see if I can get some eyes on him. me up, I don't know where that came from. I don't know where to go from here. So I was, it's hard to describe, I was in between like the streamer room building and the like, 
other building. With two the... box building. Like the... Yeah, yeah, the two the two box building. Yeah, exactly. I feel like there's someone at the back of the map. I right? think somebody's there. But I, I would have been this, uh, exit, right? Maybe, but I was covered by the building you were in. I feel like they were shooting me from kind of nowhere. One sec. We get eyes on them. This is terrible. There's yeah, there's movement at the expo. Okay, you're camping it. It sounded like the bushes at the back of my building is where they're at. I try to get nades out. I have a fuck ton of them. Oh, they're moving now. I'm just gonna go around. So you said he's by the pipes behind the, your building. I'm on that nade right there. It was last now. Got a couple more nades. I'm just gonna chuck them in that. There he is. Killed somebody who was stalking behind the boiler. Player scav. I don't know. There was too much shade. I couldn't see their clothing. One sec. Let me nade this backside again. I yeeted that one far. Jesus. I'm gonna check this guy I killed. See if it's a scav. It's definitely a player. I'm Get a silence gun. Expo. Oh, silence gun might be him. I'm leaving, good sir. Oh, he, he had OPSKS and a bunch of Chad gear. There you go. Oh, 39. What a f 39 you play this way. <laughs> Taking all of his sh He's not getting nothing. Yeah, yeah. You did get Rashala. Damn. <laughs> I, knew I it. shot him so many times, dude. Because I shot he him in the leg. There and I, I, I shot him in the face. Oh, sh**. I had like a 50 round mag with an MP5, like point blank, and he just ate it. <laughs> I just took er his everything he had. F*** you. <laughs> f camping the f***ing exit. He's a little warmed up from Marina. He's popping off. Let's go. His name was D Dummy with an H. Nice. With a raid like that, I finally felt like I was capable of playing such a punishing game as a normie gamer. My confidence was through the roof, and at that point, I felt as though I could play Tarkov as it was meant to be. Nothing could stop me now. Blind in confidence, I decided to test my luck with one of my least favorite tasks in any given wipe. One could part two? Did I do part one? I must have. Could go on reserve. F it. Take the backpack extract. That would be bad. Yeah, that could be good. Let's do that. Let's lock in.
Raiders are up here. Jesus Christ. Yep, it's gone. Okay, so I need to work my way up. Way over that way. I went the wrong way. That's fing awesome. I don't know what's shooting at me. some road kills too sweet i ended up getting bunker part 2 done later in a far less interesting raid so getting out of this one alive and with a few raider kills at that was triumphant i felt pretty disappointed i didn't get any pvp action though after such a close call so i decided to run a victor raid on factory to see if my luck had run out yet
Grim Reaper! Oh sh Oh, kill us f***ed up. Holy crap. I actually have no idea. Yeah. Well, there you have it. With some perseverance, a normie can have fun at Escape from Tarkov. Some days are definitely better than others, but I'm just happy to prove even a subpar gamer can have raids worth making a video about. And guys, I just want to thank y'all for making it to the end. I appreciate all the support I got on my last and very first Tarkov video. You guys are the best. Thanks again, and have a great day.